Bing bang, bing bang, bing bang. All right, so let me tell you one thing. Let me try to move this a little bit. All right. Um, what you see on camera is not the same thing as you see a person in reality. You know. I just saw it myself, you know, and um, uh, I was like red in the face and, and then I looked in the mirror, I wasn't red at all, so don't trust the camera, you know, it's usually uh, lights and shit like that, so two different two different things so we understand that you know uh, so what should we talk about today tinfoil first of all they sold me and I asked him is it the same wine yes yes it's fucking girl wine. It's the same percent, but next time I texted him, he's gonna owe me. Trust me. It's okay, but you don't lie, you know, you don't sell shit that people don't ask for, you know, not in this industry. Yeah, and can we talk about uh, the friend Erica? Yeah, she thought I was swollen in the face, and my friend showed me I, 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 when I was drunk. I, you know, sent him a dick picture, and he showed it to her, and she's like, "Yes, I want that," and then like. You showed a video of mine, you know, from this last few months. And she was like, well, he's like, like bloated in the face. And he looks like, so fucking what? Who gives a shit? Do you think I want her? <laughs> Who do you think they are? Who do they think they are? I don't get it. Is that why the, they have the police to protect them? Because as uh, what is his name uh, Richie from Boston said already they thought about this uh, uh, hen culture in the 17th century so what a surprise and now we have women police Oopsie coops. I just don't want them near me, even though I call them every day because I'm so bored. <laughs> but this time 
it was real because this time it was like a neighbor had harassed my friends and uh, me like I give a shit <laughs> but and I told you I opened the door to wait for my friend to come out because they closed at nine and then you got locked out and I told him can you please not close the door I just wait here for two minutes for my friend and he fucking closed it and today I went out 11.15 and the door is wide open I opened it this much it was wide open and I asked him, did you open the door? He said, yes. <laughs> so I told him, well, uh, you have a police charge on you. He said, well, I don't, yeah, whatever. So I called him again and told him, I don't think nothing's going to happen, but what I told him was like this. This is the problem. How long does it going to take? Because I don't tolerate this shit, you know. Did you do something or something bad is going to happen, you know? And I shouldn't say that, you know? Because they're going to come and pick me up. Trust me. But you don't do like that shit. I asked him to keep the door open. You know, luckily, I had one of those, um, I'm sure if I have it on me. You need one of those to get in. Luckily, I had it in my pants. Otherwise, I would be locked up, locked out until 7 o'clock in the morning or 6 o'clock all night he thought it was fun and you think I'm gonna take that? well as I told the police either you do something or something bad is gonna fucking happen and they but they, don't, they don't give a shit so But if I beat him, yep, then it's two years in jail, and then it's uh, all other kinds of shit, so four years in jail, and then, um, yep, then uh, we can really uh, give a fuck about this life, I think, you know. Uh, you know he has four, I think like four kids so I can just go in there and just you know even though I want to you know stuff fucking like it didn't start with me it started with uh, a couple of my friends he harassed they didn't understand anything a girl you know an innocent girl tried to like put her bike here and 
there was three of them. Look, uh, I just came from the supermarket. It's like, what, what, what is the problem? You, you can't put your bike here because you have no air in your uh, tire. So you, well, what, so what, what does it matter? And uh, and when I told him about the police, he was always laughing. You know, he hasn't experienced. Um, apparently, uh, how bad it can be. And I told him. You know, I was waiting for the Serbian when this happened, and he saw it. <laughs> There's no people you fuck around with. <laughs> Fucking idiots. I told him, well, I think the police is your least problem, you know. I can do it now. I can go right now. At least right there on the third floor. But I'm not going to do it like this. You know, not with substances in my body, and um, no, no, it will be a ski mask, and uh, probably uh, a few other guys, and uh, but you can understand.